Hey guys, it's me Jake from JakeMan21642. Today I've got a video for you of this beautiful 2013 Ford Focus ST. This one is a fully loaded ST3 package and this vehicle has been modified but it's been very tastefully done and it is just such a fun vehicle. As you can see on the side, this one does have very, very lightly tinted windows but you do have your body colored door handles, body colored mirrors which are heated and do have blind spot mirrors built into them as well. And up top, this one is equipped with a sunroof, your radio antenna back there, as well as spoiler. And coming along the back, one of the first things on this vehicle is your Cobb exhaust right there, which just sounds amazing. Probably one of the best exhausts you can get for the ST. Back here, you can see your Focus, as well as the ST badges. And this vehicle really does look fantastic. Over here, you do have your fuel cap on the passenger side, which you can push to release. It is Ford's easy fuel system as well. And down below, it is riding on Michelin Pilot Super Sport tires, which are probably some of the best performance tires you can get, as you can see right there. They are 235, 40, ZR18s. So it is riding on 18 inch alloy wheels. You do have slotted rear brakes as well. And if you look up inside of here, this one is riding on Bilstein shocks. So as I said, this one is just very, very well done. Pinstripe down the passenger side as well, and your intelligent entry on the passenger door. Up front, you do have projector headlights with your LED accenting, fog lights down below. Does include your typical Ford key fob with lock, unlock, and press twice to release the trunk. And another thing on this vehicle, you can just see the fitment on both of the wheels. It has been done so well. We'll go ahead, get inside. All you have to do is have the key fob with you. Come up and grab the handle, and all the doors will unlock. And then to lock, just touch right there. Inside, this one does have the premium black leather interior with the Recaro bucket seats. And we'll go ahead and start it up. All you have to do, Step inside, have the key fob with you, foot on the brake and clutch, and push right here. And you can just hear that sound from this engine. Very, very nice. Go ahead, close the door. Inside of this ST, right here you do have a very nice leather wrap steering wheel with your nice thick bolsters on each side. All of your audio system controls, as well as controls for the center display right there. Cruise control is on this side of the wheel, as well as more of your audio system and Bluetooth controls down there, and your ST badge on the bottom. On the door, up top, soft touch material since this is an ST3. Everything fits together great, and you do have a padded armrest on the door as well. All of your automatic windows, power mirrors, power locks, everything right there. The dash itself, soft touch material, it fits together great. You have your headlight controls over here. They are automatic. You can control the fogs as well trunk release and your gauge dimmer and the center gauges do have your tachometer speedometer down below is your engine temperature and fuel like I said the multifunction display which you can scroll through basically everything you need uh, on there and then up top oil temperature boost gauge and your oil pressure right there which is included on the ST and up top you're manually dimming your view mirror. Coming down, this one is equipped with the My4 Touch audio system right here. Very nice and simple to use. As you can see, this one is equipped with navigation as well. You can go through your Bluetooth phone. Down below, you also do have uh, all of your radio controls, things like that. AM, FM, Sirius, CD, USB, auxiliary, and Bluetooth, all of that. Nice and simple to use throughout this screen. Dual zone automatic climate control, which you can control from down below or bring up on the screen as well. Or just go home. In the center, you do have your uh, CD drive right here. As I said, it does have the Sony audio system with the subwoofer in the trunk. Very nice, simple to use, and it sounds so good. Down below that, dual zone automatic climate control like I just showed. You can control everything down here. You have your fan speed, different zones on each side, everything else. Down below that, you have your passenger airbag on and off, stability control on and off, as well as your defrost. This one is equipped with a Cobb short shifter as well. Very nice and tight gear shifts on this one. Pull up and over for reverse. Back here, you have your parking brake as well. Heated seats for the driver and passenger, 12 volt outlet, two cup holders right there. 
and a padded armrest back here. Storage inside, which you can open just like that. Do have your navigation SD card down there, your AVN as well as USB. The seats in this vehicle, of course, the Recaros. Just can't say enough good things about them. Nice high quality leather. You get the beautiful Recaro and ST badges on them, and they hold you in very well. And also, if you're someone like me who is 6'2 and a little bit bigger, these are a little bit different than the Recaros and the, uh, and the Fiesta ST. These are a little bit more comfortable, especially for someone my size. I fit in them absolutely perfect. Up top, do have interior lighting controls, sunroof controls, things like that. Sunglasses storage right there. Your sunroof back here. And on the Focus, when you do get the sunroof, it will move your LED interior illumination over on each side. And all of the main controls are over here as well. Have your visors with illuminated vanity mirrors. We'll go ahead, just crack the automatic driver's side window, unlock all the doors, and step out of this one. Pop the hood down here as well. Go ahead, step into the back seat of this one. Just open it right here. And since this is based on the hatchback, you do have a bit more of a comfortable back seat. The seat is a little bit further back than I would sit, but I can still fit behind myself perfectly fine. The Recaros are a little bit thicker than the regular seats, but like I said, I still fit behind myself perfectly fine. I have a nice amount of headroom. Do I have hooks up there? All the material qualities on the door and the back follow through. Padded armrest down below, things like that. Storage as well. 12 volt outlet down in the center. And an armrest with two cup holders right there. And it's the same nice leather back here with the white accent stitching. Interior lighting controls right in the center as well. And you can just hear it idle. The beautiful noise that this car makes. Inside of the trunk, go ahead and pop it right here. Once again, you do have a fantastic amount of space. This one does include both of the original rear floor mats. Underneath of here, do I have a spare tire as well, and it is a full-size spare. Like I said, you do have the uh, subwoofer for your Sony audio system. And overall, a pretty nice amount of space in the hatchback version of the Focus. You can also drop the seats. They are 60-40 split folding. Just like that, obviously you have to remove the headrest for it to fold completely flat. Like I said, you can either just slide this forward a little bit or just completely remove the headrest for it to fold flat. But everything follows through on this side. Do I have little storage compartments as well and on the door? ST badge on this side, and inside of here. This one does include your state inspection certificate, alignment report, and uh, some other receipts it looks like for different work that has been done on the vehicle. And I can tell you right now, everything on this vehicle has been done properly. This thing is very legit. And you can see too, it is lowered and it looks great, but it's also functional. It's not absolutely slammed, it's functional, it looks great, it handles well. This is really just such a nice car. Go ahead, pop the hood. Up underneath of here. This one does have Ford's 2 liter, turbocharged EcoBoost 4 cylinder. Up underneath the hood you can see you do have more Cobb goodies. Do have a cold air intake. You can see part of what I believe is the short shifter down below there. Very, very nice. Go ahead and close that.
It just sounds so good. ahead, bring the driver's side automatic window back up, and cut it off right here. Move the key, and turn the headlights back in automatic mode. As always, this vehicle is for sale at Volvo of Richmond in Richmond, Virginia. If you are interested in this vehicle, please let Volvo of Richmond know you saw this video. Thanks for watching.